Today, we're asking one of life's big questions. Can we use an 18 volt battery in our 14.4 volt drill? Well, I noticed the question gets asked quite a few times on the internet. Can I use an 18 volt battery? This is a lithium ion 18. It's a cheap replacement for a five amp hour, 90 watt, BSL 1830 in this case to replace the uh, 1430 um, batteries which we have here. These are these are both original Hitachi batteries. Um, when I bought my Hitachi drill it came with a charger that had one slot in it and it's actually an 14.4 and 18 volt charger. So I'm actually I'm actually able to charge the 18 volt battery. Now these batteries look very similar obviously the 18 volts larger but it fits into the same slot or does it so the question is how similar are they now you'll notice that all the same connections are there the same charges used and uh, and in this case we've got the same cooling the same connection so it's all exactly the same except for one difference this little notch here i'm not sure where you can see that but is not existent on the 18 volt battery so that's this notch here ties in to a little notch that's on the on the here this plastic notch prevents you from putting an 18 volt battery pack all the way in to a 14.4 volt drill however does 18 volts work on your 14.4 volt tools the answer is yes and no what i suggest you do and this is what i did is i went and found an old this one's been cleaned up it was really messy when i bought it but an old skin and it's a spare basically and i bought the 14 the 18 volt battery cheaply on the internet as an experiment and in fact when i put these together this one clips straight on because the previous owner had removed the notch so in fact what happens is you you get a much faster running drill this is the 14.4 and this is the 18 volt now is that going to wear out this drill and the answer is probably not because most drilling is done at a lower voltage than flat out you tend to you tend to do a fair bit of that and the duty cycle is not there you're not running it constantly if this was a tool that was running constantly like an angle grinder um, or a or a, um, a circular saw i wouldn't do this but because it's a drill and because this guy's already you know the previous owner already did it i completed the experiment from my perspective um, that was already cut out so i just Took, took the battery, put it on, and got off much faster. So there's not a big issue here. Um, the only thing is, if you're doing this, you'll void warranty. Uh, I don't suggest doing it on a tool that uh, has a long duty cycle. So a drill is fine, and a, a screwdriver power impact is fine but I wouldn't be doing it to uh, to a new one and this one I picked up actually very cheaply I was surprised I think I only paid 30 36 dollars I think for this skin uh, I've never seen one that cheap um, they're normally around 100 110 that I've seen on eBay um, but I've done I've done well with this I believe but that's my answer yes and no is the answer to that ultimate question